Hello guys, this is Raven from DJ Integrity. Today we are going to see some interesting tech news in episode 185. Samsung launched the Galaxy Z Fold 3 and the Z Flip 3 last month in India. The company at the time of launch announced the official pricing and availability of its two foldable smartphones. These devices has gone on sale starting today in India. Samsung was previously accepting pre-orders for the Galaxy Z Fold 3 and the Z Flip 3 in India. The customers with an HDFC bank card could get an instant cashback of rupees 7000. on the pre order of either foldable phones in addition pre booking buyers would be eligible for a free 1 year samsung careplace accidental and liquid damage protection worth rupees 7999 Samsung Galaxy M52 5G renders reveals the complete design. The phone has a polycarbonate build, a pin strip design similar to the Galaxy F62, and a triple rear camera setup. This Samsung Galaxy M52 5G specifications could include a 6.7 inch display, Snapdragon 778G processor, and a 64 megapixel primary camera. Samsung has found a way to increase your phone's RAM for free. Well, don't get too excited. It is actually a feature called RAM Plus that the company is enabling in the Galaxy A52 vs 5G. The RAM Plus feature is like old wine in a new bottle because it is a rehash of memory paging feature that already exists in Android and almost all other modern operating system. Samsung Galaxy Wi-Fi key specifications include a 6.6-inch Full HD Plus AMOLED display, MediaTek Dimensity 700 chipset, and a 5000 mAh battery. The Galaxy Wi-Fi has already gone on sale in South Korea. The new mid-range handset from the brand comes with a side-mounted fingerprint sensor. Now it is rumored that the Galaxy Wi-Fi could be rebranded as Samsung Galaxy F42 5G in India. IQ recently unveiled its new flagship phone the IQ8 series in China. IQ has launched a pro variant of this device alongside its standard flagship. Both the devices are expected to launch soon in India. IQ India is yet to make an official announcement about the same. A couple of videos about the vanilla IQ flagship has surfaced online. These videos reveal the color changing rear panel of the IQ8. The video shows that the device rear panel changes its color from white to orange when exposed to sunlight or harsh light. Google has shared a first promotional ad of its Pixel 6 series. It gives us a non-rendered look at the upcoming flagship. These smartphones are expected to launch next month. A OnePlus Note 2 unit exploded inside a lawyer's black robe in India. The lawyer will be filing a legal complaint against OnePlus. OnePlus has offered monetary compensation to the victim later refused by the lawyer. The images on the screen were shared by advocate Gaurav Gulati. This phone can be seen in the damaged condition. As per the report, the phone was in Gulati's black lawyer robe and he felt something warm in his pocket with smoke coming out. And it was a moment when he realized his OnePlus Note 2 was burning and he threw his robe away. The phone Phone later caught fire and exploded inside Gulati's chamber. Gulati says that smartphone was not plugged in for charging and the phone had 90% charge left when this incident took place. And OnePlus has reached out to Gulati and asked him to submit this device for further investigation. However, Gulati says that he will be file a legal complaint against the OnePlus India and submit the device to the police for further investigation. And he also mentioned that he will also file a complaint to the consumer court and ask the authorities to stop the sales of the OnePlus. Plus Note Two in India. The OnePlus Buds Z2 design is based on real-life images. These true wireless earbuds look almost identical to the original OnePlus Buds Z. These OnePlus Buds Z2 are expected to launch in October. Personalized ads are shown to help you discover applications, products, and services most relevant to you. The latest update has been rolled out for iOS 15 beta. Previously, Apple used it to collect this information without asking the user. Battleground Mobile India has released a new AI mode for the players. The new mode is called as Full Bot Lobby Mode. In this mode, there will be an AI characters which will pose as a real players within the battleground, shooting, looting, and moving around the map. All the players know that it will be very much easy to defeat robots in the fight. Basically, the bots make bad decision if you consider humans. The new players are supposed to play against bots in the initial days. The progress of the player will determine the number of bots the players will see in the lobby. The battleground Mobile India AI mode is not officially confirmed yet by the battleground Mobile India. This new battleground. on mobile india ai mode will boost the ranking but it will groom the players
Xiaomi Lemon Light 5G any India price and key specifications have been revealed. This phone will launch with a price tag just over Mi Lemon Light 4G. Xiaomi Lemon Light 5G any will get the same chipset as a Realme GT Master Edition. It is going to powered with the Qualcomm Snapdragon 778G chipset. While the RAM option has not been confirmed, the phone will come with a 128 GB of internal storage. Xiaomi CEO Li Jian has mentioned that in the next three years, Xiaomi will become the consistent number one smartphone brand in the country. This company has been considerably growth in recent times due to multiple factors, all of which have helped the brand evolve its brand perspective not just in China and India but in Western markets as well. Thanks for watching this video. Please kindly support my channel by giving a like, share, and subscribe, and follow Digi Integrity on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook.